long before there were dollars, euros, pounds, yen, and the many other fiat currencies, gold was the most widely accepted means of exchange. The many biblical references to gold prove that the metals have thousands of years of history as a currency and store of value. While most people do not pay for goods and services with gold these days, central banks validate gold's role in the global financial system as they hold the metal as an integral part of their foreign currency reserves. Over the past years, countries have increased their gold holdings. Gold may have reached a record high in US dollar terms in 2020 when the price of nearby COMEX gold futures traded to a peak at $2,063 per ounce, but the price moved to record territory in a host of other currencies in 2019 and 2020. Gold's value had substantially appreciated since the turn of the century when the Bank of England auctioned off one half of the UK's gold reserves. The 1999-2001 sales pushed the price to a low of $252.50 in August 1999. In 2021, most commodities posted gains, but gold was a laggard as the price declined on a year-by-year -year basis. Gold declined in 2021. Nearby COMEX gold futures closed at $1,893.10 on December 31, 2021. Gold futures closed at $1,827.50 per ounce on December 31, 2021, a 3.5% decline for the year. While many other commodities rose to multi-year or all-time highs in 2021, gold lagged the asset class an inside year of digestion and consolidation. Gold did not follow through on the upside in 2021 after reaching a new record peak at $2,063 per ounce in 2020. The long-term chart shows gold $610.90 range from $1,452.10 to $2,063 in 2020. In 2021, Gold's low was $1,673.70, with the high at $1,959.90 per ounce, a $286.20 trading band. Gold's range was less than half the level in 2021 than in 2020. The precious metal did not make a higher high or lower low in 2021, making it an inside year for the precious metal. Gold spent 2021 digesting the move to a new high in 2020 and consolidating. Gold continues to trade around the $1,800 pivot point. The narrower trading range in 2021 led gold to trade around a pivot point price last year. Each time gold fell below or rose above the $1,800 per ounce level, the price moved back to the pivot point, which became magnetic for the price during 2021. Three factors that are bullish for gold at the beginning of 2022. In early 2022, three factors point to higher gold prices this year. The most recent consumer price index data show that inflation rose to 7% in 2021, the highest level in four decades. Core inflation, excluding food and energy, at 5.5% was far above the U.S. Federal Reserve's 2% average target rate. Gold is an inflation barometer as governments can print fiat currency to their heart's content, but they can only increase the gold supply by purchasing the metal or extracting it from the Earth's crust. At the December 2021 FOMC meeting, the Fed forecasts the short-term Fed funds rate will rise to 0.9% in 2022 and 1.6% in 2023. Even if inflation recedes, real interest rates will remain negative in 2022 and perhaps in 2023, which is bullish for gold. The technical pattern of lower highs and higher lows since March 2021 suggests that a breakout from the $1,800 per ounce pivot point could be on the horizon. The wedge pattern of lower highs and higher lows. A break above the mid-November $1,869.70 high on the active month February contract could ignite a significant technical rally in the gold market. Consolidation is healthy in a market that has been trending for years. Every dip this century has been a buying opportunity. When the Bank of England decided to sell half of its gold reserves at the turn of the century, 
gold made a significant bottom at $252.50 per ounce. The long-term chart dating back to the 1970s when gold began trading on the COMEX futures exchange illustrates that every period of price weakness since 1999 has been a buying opportunity. With inflation at the highest level in years, the odds favor a resumption of the bullish trend after gold consolidated in 2021. Time will tell if 2022 is a year where gold will rise to new record highs. However, the overall tone of the commodities asset class suggests it is only a matter of time before gold rejoins the bullish party.